he's he's 19. He's still 19. Yeah, he turns off his own effect, and he sells the materials. Right? That got him for me. Take down board? Was that normal or special? I normal. normal. Okay. Did you draw off Maxi for that? No. I drew off the Maxi yeah. when you do this. Okay. Yeah. So I'm saying you drew off from the take board? You can, you can, uh, you can yeah. add the he, card to yeah, my hand. It's only one no. person, so. No, no, he didn't do it. Okay. Yeah, fine. yeah. I trust him. It's not going to do it. We, all, we can count the cards. Yeah, yeah. So. I, I mean, well, so yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're fine. fine. We're good. Even if they said something, I wouldn't. Yeah. Yeah.
So you're out of your XYZ, right? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, right? Yep. Ogre? Okay, and it's still a rat. It's oh, I thought you were... No. Oh, shit. Whatever. I guess I did. Okay. Do you care? Huh? I thought you were... Okay. Uh, I mean, okay, that's fine. You have yeah, two in hand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And just like that, the game was stolen. Incredible. Oh, I get to draw from Maxi. I don't know if it, I don't think it'll change it.
I assume Tanky's like Hanger and you can't Ghost Ogre it. Ned won game one. chose not to do it, and that's why I'm very confused. Ned Salkovich won game one. So you can't. You can't? Okay. I assume because it's like famous. Yeah. So Tenki could not be ghost ogred. And it's the same rolling as Union Hanger, where it activates on activation. It will search. It won't it will still search. Yeah, I played Ned round one, and uh, he steamrolled me. I had very unfortunate draws this weekend, but Ned is playing some very strange cards. Corey Roca is commentating. That is me. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I was a poor choice for money this weekend. I played two matches and I bricked three of the four games. I should have played the Dark Lords. Uh, my name on DN was Rockstar Roca. I ended up playing D to D today, maining triple Gofu, but like 
my hands were not lost to like drawing multiple gofu or anything like that. I actually drew triple red slime and uh, triple contract, the search contract. It was just, they were just all 1%. Uh, my name on Dueling Book is Rockstar Roka. Uh, lawn mowing deck, honestly, I've, there's so much of it at the top tables. It is guaranteed topping this event. Um, there's also a lawn mowing um, frog deck that like dumps all the traps. So it's just like, it's actually just insane looking. It's like one trap becomes almost like a soul charge. Because you just play all your back rows and you special summon four guys. So it's, it's a pretty absurd. All right, it looks like Silverman's got two back row and a totem bird. It's very established. Even one strike or anything actually can just end this game with just one more normal summon. I'll post my DDD list later if you guys want. Low mowing Dark World Lord. I do love Dark Lord. No, Ned was never banned. He just stopped playing for a long time. We need a gossip channel. There is so much Yu-Gi-Oh gossip, and there are so many things that get thrown around that are just never true. And yes, that is... Uh, what the deck does. It summons Totem Bird and then it kills you 10 turns later. I love Peter so much. I'm going to be in Peter's bed. <laughs> XD. I've actually never played Cosmos. Yeah. No, no, he can. Slumber can activate when your opponent controls a kaiju. The field is then cleared, so there is never more than one kaiju on the field at one time. No, there, you, you can't activate it with no monsters, but there was a monster. No, there, nothing was summoned. Yeah, I haven't seen anything that was unfair yet. Is that a back row or did you draw a back row? Go ahead. No, I'm not on PPG anymore. Strong warning. Uh, Luke1225, the deck actually has a rebirth. You go through your entire engine once, and then the trap banishes and adds it all back to your deck, and then you do it one more time. So it's like, 
Yu-Gi-Oh doesn't last more than two turns anyway now, so you pretty much just sit there and grind back and forth if it's a Zodiac matchup. But usually you get two big turns. <laughs> Steve is just praying, praying to his deck right now. Uh, there was 158 players, if I'm not mistaken. I would definitely play the zoo trap. It's it's honestly it's. I'm going for it. It's a mini pot of avarice. It's just it's very good. Definitely one copy. Uh, Pat is currently out. He's still playing for the PPG team, though. Um, I just talked to him last round, and he is... <laughs> he's just trying to stay in. He's currently X3, I believe. Day two starts tomorrow at nine. Usually like not between like nine, nine twenty is honestly when I'd pinpoint it. Man, Ghost Ogre. I think Ghost Ogre after this event is going to see a lot more play. It's, it seems to be extremely popular in a lot of these decks today. Uh, Pat played Noids. Uh, 60 cards, and uh, it 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 was probably a mistake. I don't know if I can ever condone playing more than 40 cards. He played 60 card Infernoid today. He did play Upstart. Well, yeah. Uh, you still need your deck count to be at 60. So, um, yeah. The it's. I mean. A one card thin and a 60 card deck when you're trying to see three copies of a card. It's still the same concept as a 40. Um, the undefeateds are Nick Ma and Fraser Smith, I believe. Um, I'm looking up there right now. There might be three, but I'm not entirely sure. Maybe Guyton Georges. Gate and Georges. Uh, and that's it. Yeah, but shout out this weekend to anybody who got up here, man. There was two foot of snow when I got here, and we're getting another foot tonight. I might be here till next week. It's definitely going to be a long week. Uh, Frazier is playing Foes with Zoo. Um, Nick Ma is playing Foes with Zoo. And... Uh, Guyton is playing 60 card Infernoid Zoo Terra Top Special Turbo. Yep, got it. Nailed it. <laughs> so it looks like Silverman took a pretty commanding push here in this game. Granted, I. I, I must say, like, it's so hard to put damage on the field with the Zoo deck. At least with the Zoo engine. 
Like, you're basically killing somebody with a kaiju. It's kind of just crazy. Yes. Hmm? Why is Mirror Force seeing play? Uh, regular Mirror Force is seeing play in the mirror. Uh, there's no other battle traps. It's actually very good. It's not bad. Basically all mass removal traps. I'm seeing a lot of Torrential today, a lot of Mirror Force. Anything that is just complete board wipe. Dark Hole, Raigeki, they're all very important again. Thank God. Yeah. There it goes, whip tail. Yeah, if he's not out of dry dents, this game actually just might... I, I don't... It, this is just so much back and forth. Uh, we haven't seen this in Yu-Gi-Oh! in so long. This is actually really refreshing. Yeah, and I apologize for the internet. I blame Trevor personally. <laughs> he said he's a bad person. <laughs> Two back rows. Full field presence. I would be willing to put money on it that one of those back rows is a bluff. Mr. Silverman always sets the bluffs. Another slumber. Crack. Ooh. Alright, so if I'm right, the other one is indeed a, uh, a bluff. We'll never know. Two minutes, 20 seconds. All right, looks like Silverman takes game two. My goodness, two minutes left on the clock. They better hurry up. <clears throat> Shout out to Brandy McGee. This is live. <laughs> Did that help? All right, game three here. With 30 seconds left on the clock. Play fast. Got the goods. Normal summon. I am very hungry. That is what I just noticed. Would you add? Yeah. Mm. 
No take backs. Oh no. <coughs> I'm pretty sure that Ned isn't on PPG. Uh, a lot of the uh, the teams were handing out shirts today so that they could have six players. Yep. So obviously Ned is an accomplished player, so they probably wanted him on the team, at least for the day. Uh, I am 100% on that. Because my friend Johan is playing for... Uh, oh, yes, I am extremely hungry. That is for certain. But I'm also 100% on the team situation as well. I think I'm going to get a steak. Everyone's been talking about steak today. Yeah, steak's insane. Yeah, I think I'm going to go to Outback. There's an Outback 10 minutes away from here. You going to get milk steak? Uh, no. No, not at all. I'm going to probably get the bison steak. They have actually like a bison slab. Yep, I'm drooling. We only got one round left then. Uh, that's the last thing I want to eat. Thank you, though. Although, I don't know, if there's a few more rounds, that's, that'll do. Is there something about this game that I haven't uh, commentated on that you would like some explaining? How could you not care about steak? Thank you. Steak is love. Steak is life. Thank you. Thank you. Solid. <laughs> How you doing? Are you in? X3. X3? That's not in. No, not at all. How I about you? I, yeah, we had to play. Oh, you guys had to play? Yeah. Rough. Peter, Peter got knocked out. Almost X1. Good. At least somebody would get in. I did horrible. Sorry, guys. I wish I did better. Trust me. No. <laughs> Yeah, I played on uh, Team Jank today, and um, I got a, uh, I did bad for them today. <laughs> if you're really trying to hear me rap, like, I, I can do it. And I prefer Rockstar Roka, if you don't mind. And Ned is not on PPG for the last time. Ned is... Not on PPG. If Ned wins the tournament, maybe he will be on PPG. But I'm pretty sure that Ned already is sponsored by TCG Singles. I am not on PPG.
Uh, PPG is next to his name because today he is playing for uh, for the team, but it's like it's for the team war. Thank you. I couldn't find the words. It's it's just for the team war. Like he is not on squad. He is adjacent from squad. I must say, Zodiac is definitely the new Fire Fist. Summon? Did my normal summon go through? Yes. Okay. I overlay into Rhoda. I overlay into Dryden, which is... That card's just great. Tell Frank, Nicola, uh, I would love to rap on stream. I just need the limelight, you know? I just got to go in sometimes. Zoman actually seems pretty calm right now. I would not be calm if he was if I was him. He's showing little to no emotion. He must have the nastiest traps. But at the same time, if if nothing's if a trap hasn't been activated yet, it's probably not gonna get activated. I, I don't know. What are those back row? Maybe a slumber set? I whew. I don't know. Needle ceiling would be nice. Well, Ned's playing around Mirror Force now. Yeah, the ARG Spellground does look great. I'm not sure if they're on sale yet. Are they on sale, Trevor? It's on the website. It's something Did you there you go. Uh, it's a gem brand. It's not necessarily Spellground, but uh, it does feel very, very identical to Spellground. And they're on. I, Trevor told me that they might be on sale on the site. Yeah, he's looking it up now. Matt looks great. Correction, it does not look like it's actually on the site. Could it be under, yeah, gear. I was just about to say that. Try and uh, look up mats. Is there actually just Matt? Yeah. That's weird. How is nothing coming up for mats? Oh. All right, so dry dent pop, attack. If I had a mirror force, I'd flip it up now, honestly. Oh, never mind. He's at eight thousand. Ned's not moving those cards. I know that for a fact. So Silverman needs to draw a normal summon, which sounds really stupid to me. Yeah, he's down to 47. He took 33. Here it is. Normal summon. Let's see. Here we are. Set slumber. Come on.
Well, I guess if he has the big kaiju, he can actually just start swinging over his monsters. But Dryden's still there, so actually, there's just. Senior Silverman seems like he's in a pretty rough thing. Yeah, so here's the big kaiju. Oh, cool. So, yeah, Jim put a link in the chat for the mat. Almost became a rapper. Five available, probably gone by now. <laughs> we'll check. At least click the button to get denied. Yeah, that's crazy. Five available. They're going to be gone, man. So, jump on that site and buy one. Awkward. Next round was called, and uh, I don't know if you guys know this, but they're still playing. I must say, this has been a really well-run tournament. This is like, we're going to get over probably by like 8 o'clock tonight. Like, and that's, that's just prime for any tournament, especially when we're starting at 10. Like this is this is good. I'm I'm happy. Yeah, I don't know. I guess you have to dry dent here. Yeah. All right, so dry dent. Let's see if Silverman has a strike. If he has a strike, this will be a very big swing. No strike. Looks like Silverman just realized he can't use it. Am I able to activate this or no? Because uh, I already tried to activate this one, but you go so weird it. I don't know if it's. I can't use it, right? You can't use it. So I can't even flip it? Uh, you can flip it, you okay. just cannot use the. Gotcha. It says you can only use the effect on your So he's allowed to flip it. Bam. The nastiest of the kaijus. The thing is, I think Ned just has way too much momentum. 
Like, I guess naturally he would kill Emeril here. Well, it all depends. How many yeah. Correct. Silverman has not flipped up any of his cards. Honestly, his back row, he didn't activate it. it pro no, it's a mirror force. Silverman is siding... Metal Raiders Mirror Force. <laughs> MRD. And there's the Max C. This is turn four of time. All right. They each get three, correct? All right. Just check it. I, I don't go into time, so I don't. I don't know. Cut me to it. Silverman is going to have a lot of cards on his turn, but he drew a lot of purples. Sorry about that, lost my head. And what were you saying? Oh, you drew Takatomborg. That's a powerful monster. 600 normal. What would you say it was? Petite dragon. That's broken. <laughs> All day. Uh, 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 I guess the max you could draw him into ogre.
Silverman would not still be playing if there was no way. So I am very interested to see what he's cooking up right now. And the mats are officially gone. Sold out. Gone. Vominos. Make sure you have all of your deck, and I have all of my deck. Now both these people are X1 at this time. Oh, yeah, right. they have to be X1 